Hello viewers, welcome to linuxhelp.com. Now I am going to explain how to install Grav CMS application on Ubuntu 17.04. First of all, Grav is a free and open source content management system. The Grav does not use a database to store data. Instead of data is stored in a flat files in markdown format. The Grav is written in PHP and contains a score of plugins for users to use. The Grav CMS requires a web server to functionally based on LAMP setup on your system and some of the required PHP modules. I have already installed and configured LAMP setup on my system, so I have to proceed the installation of Grav CMS application on my system. Before we have to install the application, we should update the system repository using this following command. Then hit enter. The repository is updating now. Then we have to create a new database to accessing a Grav CMS application using this following steps. Then hit enter. And then here we have to give the root password. The database console is open now. And then here we have to create a new database. And then hit enter. Now we have to create a new user and give the privileges to access this Grav database. then hit enter now we have to flush the privileges then hit enter now we have to exit from this database console then hit enter now we have to switch into the following directory slash temp then hit enter and then here we have to download a package using this following command then hit enter the package is downloading now the downloading process was completed now now we have to list out the files and then here we can see the downloaded file now we have to change into the following directory then hit enter and then here we have to list out the files and then here we can see the grav directory now we have to change the ownership and permission for this grav directory then hit enter now we have to change the permission for the grav directory then hit enter then we have to make some changes inside a php ana configuration file so we have to open a php ana configuration file then hit enter the file is open now and then here we have to set the value of file uploads here we have to check it out the value is on and then here also we have to check it out the value is on then we have to set the value of memory limit then hit enter and then here we have to set the value of 256 MB then we have to set the value of upload maximum file size then hit enter and then here we have to set the value of 100 MB then we have to set the value of maximum execution time and then here we have to set the value of 360 then we have to set the value of date and time zone first we have to uncommon this line and then I have to set the value of RCA slash Kolkata after making changes we have to save and exit from this file then we have to create a new virtualhost configuration to accessing a grav cms application and then hit enter and then here we have to proceed the virtualhost configuration after configuring virtualhost we have to save and exit from this file now we have to Enable the rewrite module using this following command. Then hit enter. And then here it will ask for restart the Apache service. So we have to restart the Apache service using this following command. Then hit enter. 
then we have to enable the site access for new creation of graph virtual host configuration using this following command here we have to mention a configuration file name then hit enter and then here also it will ask for restart the Apache service so we have to restart the Apache service now we have to disable the default site access then hit enter and then here also it will ask for restart the Apache service so we have to restart the Apache service once again then hit enter now we have to open a browser the browser is open now and then here we have to give the following URL and then here we have to mention a local IP address or a domain name so I have to give my domain name then hit enter the site is open now and then here we have to give the username so I have to give my username and then here we have to give the email address then we have to give the password for this user again we have to give the password then we have to give the full name and then here we have to give the title I have to give admin then I have to click create user the site is open now and then here we can see the profile name and then here we can see the major configuration modules if you want to know the what is the version it has been installed graph CMS application on your system please scroll down here and then here you can see the what is the version it has been installed graph CMS application on your system these are all the installation process about how to install graph CMS application on Ubuntu 17.04 thank you for watching this video please subscribe our channel Linuxhelp to more further videos visit www.linuxhelp.com for any queries mail to support at linuxhelp.com